Dodge and the Old Stone Bridge. One day, Dodge was on his way to Nafford Station. He had a very important delivery. Dodge arrived bang on time at Nafford, so Topham Hat was waiting for him. Well done, Dodge. You are proving yourself to be a really useful engine. Thank you, sir. It feels great to be really useful. Well, that's good to hear, cause I have another job for ya. I want you to take a goods train and take it to Nafford Harbor. No problem, sir. And with that, Dodge rolled away. Ah 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 ah! Silly diesels, always pulling cars. But Dodge didn't hear him. Dodge had a favorite line he loved to go on. It was an old line. Dodge would only use it if he had to get somewhere quick. He knew this line better than anyone on Sodor. Just as the points changed, Dodge was on his way. The line was very old and hasn't been used. The tracks were very bumpy. Up ahead was a very old bridge. It was made out of stone and wasn't made for big engines. And of course, the bridge hasn't been used in a very long time. Dodge knew this, and he was always careful when traveling across it. Okay, here goes nothing. Dodge slowly climbed up the bridge. When he got to the top, he stopped and took a few minutes to look at the view. <coughs> After that, he roared down the line. We, wow! <laughs> Dodge arrived at the goods yard where Diesel was shutting his cars. Get in line, trucks! <sighs> Dodge was surprised. Oh, hello, best friend. How are you doing? I'm doing good, thank you. Are these my cars? Yes, it is. Wait here while I go get the rest of your train. Once his train was ready, Dodge was buffered up and set off to Nefford Harbor. Bye, best friend. Dodge rolled along the line with his heavy goods train. He was going to use his old line again. Once the points were changed, Dodge roared down the line. He went up and over the bridge. He heard his way back onto the line. Oh, hello, Dodge. How are you doing? Sorry, I can't stop, Thomas. I have a delivery to take to Napford Harbor. Goodbye, Dodge. It wasn't too long till Dodge arrived at Napford Harbor. Here we are. The dock manager arrived. He was very pleased. Well done. Now I need you to collect the jet engine from the Vicarstown goods yard, please. No problem, sir. Gordon was at Nafford Station until Dodge roared past him. Wait right there, little Diesel. Ah, what the? I'm on, Gordon. I have no time for this. I got to collect the jet engine to Nafford Harbor. I have noticed, Dodge. You seem to be gaining here and there and everywhere so quickly. That's because I work very hard and I'm very fast. Nonsense, Dodge. You were here thirty minutes ago. Well, you're just jealous. Gordon didn't believe Dodge. He knew something was up. Hmm. You know, maybe I should follow him. Maybe there's some secret he knows that I don't. Gordon left his coaches at the station and went after Dodge. Not long after, Gordon found an old line. I wonder if Dodge had been using this old line. Time to find out. Gordon puffed slowly along the old line. He found it very interesting. He came upon the old bridge. Gordon heard cracks as he puffed across the bridge. Gordon knew straight away Dodge was using this line. Gordon, what are you doing on my line? Ha ha! So you admit you have an old line? Well, I, I. There's no point in hiding it now. Once everyone hears about it, 
it will become the express line from now on. <laughs> Matt, but oh, Dodge was not very happy with Gordon. He had found his own line, and now it was no secret to him anymore. The next morning, Gordon picked up some passengers and was getting ready to show them Dodge's line. Soon it'll be my line, he whispered to himself. Gordon puffed away out of the docks. Meanwhile, Dodge was not happy. I can't believe it. What don't you believe? I had a secret old line I would travel on, and Gordon found it. Oh dear! I'm sorry, Dodge. Yeah, I'm sorry too, Dodge. Now he's going to take the express on it. Sooner or later, it won't be my line anymore. Wait, Dodge! Did you say ah? Phew! That was close. What are you gonna say, Thomas? I was trying to say, Dodge. Did you say that line was old? Yeah. Why? Uh oh. Express coming through. Oh no, Gordon! Out of my way, Henry. <laughs> Gordon, what are you playing at? Excuse me, Henry. Well, now I've seen everything. Gordon, stop! But it was too late. Yeah! Whoa! Gordon! Uh, uh, help! Dodge! Do something! Help! Hold on, Gordon. I'm going to pull you back. Dodge slowly buffered up behind Gordon's coach. Oh! oh help! Dodge pulled as hard as he could. Oh! 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 Easy! Easy! Oh! You're almost there! Yes, you almost got it! Ah! I'm going to fall! Oh! 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 Bust my buffers! Oh! 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 Hello, Gordon. Thomas, you know this line too? No, Dodge told me. Then there was trouble. Sir Topham had arrived. He was not happy. Gordon, you have caused confusion and delay. You took your express passengers down the old line instead of the express line. I'm sorry, sir. I discovered this old line, so I wanted to show my express passengers. I promise it won't happen again. Very well. And as for you, Dodge. You should not be using this line at all, Dodge. It's not safe for anyone to use. Yes, sir. I'm sorry, sir. To prevent engines from going on the old line, Sir Tom Hat had closed it. Hey, Dodge. Are you okay? I'm fine, Thomas. I just wish my line wasn't closed. Gordon, sorry for following you and finding your old line. That's all right. Sir Tom Hat's right too. This line is too old and dangerous for engines to be using. We got an empty berth at Timmy's sheds. You're free to come over and sleep. Thanks, Thomas. I'll be right there. Okay, Dodge. <coughs> Dodge the diesel had a very old line. He would use it for his traveling journeys, but now that it's closed. He knew there was no way of bringing it back, but let me tell you a secret: it was later rebuilt. But that's a story for another day.